Hey everyone, Daniel Vadnall, Fitness FAQs. Today's video, I'm gonna to bring to you 10 calisthenics athletes you must be following on Instagram. These people are educational, motivational, inspirational. I've looked at their profiles for a long period of time. They post quality content on a frequent basis. It'll keep you motivated and inspired with your daily training progress. Guys, if you aren't already, follow me on Instagram, at fitnessfaqs. I'm posting training clips, educational content quite frequently to keep you guys making the best progress possible. Before we get into the video, I want you to comment below what your Instagram profile is. I'm gonna look through all the comments, suss out your profiles, and I'm going to put the five best profiles that I see that deserve recognition in the comment section as a pinned post. This way more people are going to see your profile, get you some more reach and recognition as well. Write your comment below and you might just get picked. This first guy is an absolute animal. I don't use that term loosely. Maxim Trukanovets, I hope I pronounced that right. He is absolutely diced to the socks, shredded, incredible body composition, looks amazing. Performance matches the appearance. He is incredible at sets and reps. Definitely motivating if you're trying to improve your endurance game. I believe he has a world record in pull-ups. He posts quality sets. I mean, the type of stuff that he does would almost be equivalent to some people's entire workout in one set. That's how crazy this guy is. You can see the discipline with his frequency of his posts and he really puts his heart and soul into what he does. Definitely someone you should be following. Next up, Vitaly Feschuk. This guy is tall and he is heavy. So for those of you out there that are like, oh, I'm too tall, I'm too heavy, I can't achieve planches, levers, no excuses guys. There are people out there who can do it. They show us that it is possible. Especially in my situation, this guy has similar stats to me. Gives me a reality check. It shows me I can achieve so much more than I believe. It takes the limits, the self-imposed limits off yourself when you see tall heavyweights performing advanced bodyweight skills with ease. It shows you that you can do it as well. This guy is just incredible. I highly recommend that you follow him. Just there's no excuse in terms of what we can or can't do when we see others showing us what's possible. Let's take a look at Denton Conti. This guy is a hard hitter from the UK. The UK breeds that work ethic, that passion and that drive just to post that real training, you know, that in the field, in the trenches, just grinding out for every bit of progress. I like this guy because he's well-rounded. He is just really, really strong at weighted calisthenics. He has got a good endurance on regular calisthenics. Skill game is on point as well. So doing it for time and for quality and doing it in a freestyle fashion as well. This guy's got it all. What's also good about him too, he's been working on his deadlifts and his squats, his major compound exercises, and he's really good at them too. I think this guy is built to deadlift. He's got good leverages for it. But what makes him interesting is he's not short either. He's juggling a few different training aspects at the same time and managing to be good at all of them simultaneously. That's a real challenge and that's something that you don't see often. That's why following people like Denton reminds us what we can do if we put in the work ethic on a consistent basis. Next up, a Russian lad that you guys should check out, Dima underscore Kuzia. You know if they're Russian, they're training hard, they're training raw. This guy has got crazy skills. He's full range of motion, really long periods of time spent in these advanced isometric positions, skill-based movements. Your planches, your levers, this guy's got them on lock. And he also has the basics down too. So if you're looking for heavy pulls, heavy dips, this guy's your man. We can all take something from that Russian work ethic, train hard, train often, and train with quality. Dima underscore Kuzia, 
I salute you, bro. You're training well. Let me prepare my international pronunciation. Osvaldo Lugones is just the best when it comes to skills. This guy does things constantly that make me question what is possible. Every single post is to a very high standard and will make you go, wow, how is this guy doing this? Not only in terms of exercise difficulty, but how he sequences things and combines things and does it for such a long period of time. It's just crazy how these guys can do sets that last so long at such a high level. If you guys want that constant motivation, check out this guy. He never fails to disappoint. Misha Schultz is a German calisthenics athlete who is literally at the top. He's something that we should all strive for if we want to be well-rounded. I say this because he's got an awesome physique. He's extremely strong, so he's posting weighted squats, deadlifts to a high extent in relation to his body weight. He's also got weighted calisthenics game on lock. Heavy, heavy movements, guys. He's really pushing the boundaries of what we think is possible. And he's got the skills to match. So all calisthenics skills, clean, full range of motion. Check him out, guys. You won't be disappointed. He posts quality and often. Matteo Spinozola is someone that I've been following since I first started training. What I like about this guy, he never settles for the status quo. He's always trying to push the boundaries, achieve new things that we didn't think were possible. He's on the shorter side, but don't let that take anything away from his achievements. I guarantee 99 other people, same height, same weight, same genetics, same limb lengths, would not get anywhere close to what this guy can do with his body. Work ethic, tick, trains really hard. His posts always just about raw training clips, not trying to sell you anything. That's what we want to see in an Instagrammer, not just constantly bombarding you with other stuff that we don't want to see. Check him out, Matteo, I salute you brother once again. You've been inspiring me a long time. I thank you a lot. I'm not quite sure what this guy's real name is, but his Instagram is Barky underscore HD. He's a pretty big guy in terms of muscular size. He's not that tall, but if you guys are looking for people to follow that are quite big, throwing their body weight around, this is someone you should follow. He loves his sets and reps, loves his weighted basics, but he's also quite good at your skill-based movements as well. Post quite frequently, good value, definitely someone I recommend to follow. If you're into freestyle calisthenics, street workout, more tricks and flips on the bar, Flying Korash is someone for you to check out. He's revolutionizing the game with freestyle to music, different sequences, different ways of doing things. Definitely if it's your cup of tea in terms of seeing freestyle street workout, really skill-based stuff, check out his channel. If you guys want planche motivation, you want to see someone that is a master at the planche, Mikhail Casoria is the guy to follow. Just a constant reminder of just what beautiful planche form looks like. Straight arms, posterior pelvic tilt, hollow body. He's doing the planche in so many different ways, on the floor, on the bars. He's got all different variations of planche ticked. He's doing Maltesers. He's just an absolute master. He's a professor of the planche. Thanks guys for watching. Thumbs up the video if you enjoy this style of content. If you do, I'll keep making more. I'll make a series out of it where I bring you the best of the best that you might not be exposed to in your regular Instagram feed. Peace out, train hard, and I'll see you soon.